we definitely have some brownish stain marks already on this side. Hello YouTube, this is Dutch Bushkov of Knives and today I want to do a comparison between the stain resistance or corrosion resistance between CPM3V and A2 because a lot of people have asked me lately um, how these two uh, perform in corrosion resistance so which one rusts faster and I can already tell you that is the A2 but um, I actually never really experienced rust on my CPM3V so in this video, in this short video, I just want to show you guys what you can actually expect uh, of these two steels in, uh, when you're living in a wet condition. So I'm gonna, going to actually wet these steels and show you how they look after an hour or so. Let's see what we can do. Alright, so for the stain test, I'm just lying these knives flat here in the... In this dry part uh, it's very moist outside so um, it won't evaporate that quickly so let's see what happens if you would lie your knife in the rain as example so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a droplet on both as you can see and um, I'm going to set the timer on 60 minutes one hour and um, yeah we'll see what the result is of one hour stain on the blade can't wait <laughs> yeah guys this is for research purpose and I will sacrifice myself so you guys don't have to try and uh, I hope you guys can uh, get a idea of how these steels would perform in your kind of situation if you're living in a moist area with a lot of rain or if you're living in a dry and it doesn't matter so you can make a um, you can make an indication for yourself on how this knife would perform in your area so yeah let's come back in one hour so cpm 3v No stains at all, and this is why I kind of experienced this. Uh, C the CPM 3V is almost semi stainless. So let's check out how the gunny has done. You can definitely see that this. A1 has been affected by the water, while the CPM 3V remains perfectly in its satin finish. And uh, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. We definitely have some uh, brownish stain marks already on this side. So, and these brown, brown. These brown rust pits, or these brown rust parts, are uh, the ones that will form the pits. So yeah, guys, there you have it. So in my opinion, the cpm 3 v is almost like a semi-stainless steel. Well, this, um, well, this A1 doesn't last an hour in the rain without rusting. Um, and when you're doing jobs in the rain around the camp, an hour uh, will pass before you know it. So, um, yeah, if you're living or if you're living in a humid, wet land like I do, I can highly recommend going with CPM 3V. It is worth the extra money. Uh, if you know how to sharpen, go with CPM 3V. The A2 is much more easy to sharpen, of course, but it will rust like crazy. And I have had multiple instances where I really, really um, had to clean my whole knife again because it was just rusted. Uh, 
So yeah, even, even when I was sharpening, when I'm sharpening multiple knives, like five knives at a time, and I'm uh, putting away this knife because it's done uh, on the 400 stone, and I and I'm continue with the other knives, this knife can rust before I even go to the 1000 stone. So yeah, A2, not so stain resistant, corrosion resistant, CPM through V, pretty corrosion resistant. Guys, it's raining like crazy, so thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. Uh, see you. And I will do some more tests like this in the future. Adios.